Who wanna start? I feel like I start and I I, I expand too much. Yeah. So I need to speak. Always also I take notes to prevent this. Yeah. So yeah. I, Things that happen when we are practicing. Um, is a uh, basically one has yeah uh, can reply or not to things. So sometimes that that literally comes from this phase that now to know more about the hybrid coding platform that we use in myself. So sometimes for instance like in the practice I need to ask things that I don't know, but then also not to sometimes he'll reply, but sometimes not. So early in the process that was very confusing for me because I don't know like it now or not. So it's, it's a, I'm, I'm bringing it because it can be similar in that space. In time we spoke about it, like we situate what happened. And I think the way for, I think the, uh, I see the space is that one has the agency to respond or not. To the call. Um, at some point, for instance, in, in, in the in the practice, uh, when I was I was repeating a sentence, and then now to start doing what it was. I don't remember if it was something about math or it's not stupid or something. And then now to start asking me, and there are replies. But at some point, I asked was not replying. So I think that's kind of literally. But there are other ones here that are a bit more abstract. That said, is more like from I think the what they call a sandbox. But I think the difference is that uh, we don't have so much time with you and then we need to clarify and we don't know, we need to define too. 
what are the things that we need you to help us, right? So I think um, we need to see how deep into this um, uh, functions or like the, how deep into the practice you go, you know, as, as us, uh, or yeah, as that understanding that, say like if you are in the practice, it's kind of like in a deep level, how deep into that onion you go. Because we need, I, I think I like this idea of the fire fighter. We need uh, you to help us uh, to work with the, to take care of the sound. Mm -hmm. um, uh, but then you know, also we have to be careful. Uh, so I have a proposition for that today. That that maybe we can repeat the same. But then um, because the sound is so strong and so dominant, so that we know enter into a ritual space of the sound. Uh, at least for today, because that, that was part of some. Uh, but maybe uh, I just wanted to, I guess, answer uh, there was something directly in terms of the communication, and then I guess. But all these things are abstraction at this point. We need we need to find ways how to address things that are non-negotiable. For instance, when we were saying this in the performance, in and out was that kind of thing. It's like at this point, I need your help. So and also it's like I get it. this idea with in was like a is uh, most or all was like focus of energy attention was everything. So it's like now you're with me, so you stop, like you take a, a, a posture that is clearly towards me. If I say in, the person is there, and the other one is doing what he needs. And if he needs my help, it clearly say Jorge, can you move this with me? Uh, but otherwise, the person is just there to support. Uh, but that's what we found in the performance of us. So, could be that we find, we need to find uh, something uh, to. I will say like that because it comes from you that maybe that if you, you, you can try to find a word or, oh, or how could. Can we help you to to feel more comfortable in that space? Like, for, like, oh, let's go back to the, the example for for now. Also, can you can you? Maybe so. Did you finish or not yet? Um. Yeah, points. Yeah. Just just uh, maybe a couple of small things. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Go. Yeah. Go ahead. Uh, no, just one thing. Was I don't. My voice sounds so tiny. Yeah. Can you go back uh, to the example of Naoto, what you were saying? Like at the moment? Uh, yeah, uh, just on the video, it's, I noticed Naoto's waiting for a moment with the microphone and, uh, and, uh, and then that I didn't loop it and I just wondered if maybe that okay. was what Mr. Naoto ah, okay. wanted. So how, like, me first, we can just, like, in this moment, then try to find a possible solution. I think we should go around first. Yes? Okay. Yeah. I just keep it somewhere. I like, also keep it, like, maybe for you that underline that something that it's, it needs to be closed. This is open. Yeah. That needs to be solved. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yes. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah.
So in the third tree, the I noticed that. So I, I went to have this X, and that was quite. Uh, it has a shape right away, you know, like the sound is. Uh, the sound of the X is quite concrete and also not that much, so it's easy to just do something. It, by itself, is a lot. Uh, without being too much. So that was in the minus three. Then at some point I felt so this is I think it's something interesting. Uh, and the minus five or point thirty five here in the show. There's a feedback at some point. There's a feedback. There's a feedback. So this is kind of like embedded language, I guess, like with Naoko we have this thing. So there is there is something happening. There was a feedback. So that there is something annoying. There was a, a feedback sound. Um, like feedback from sound. Like sound, like just annoying sound. It was like yeah, when feedback sound. Yeah. And uh, I don't know. Anyway, so this is to say like that was interesting uh, to see. Because we 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 now just automatically we do this thing. Like I I also at some point asked if I was doing all this similar thing. We have embedded language, so something is happening and then we transform it into that. There was a noise, something there was a feedback sound and then we both start doing this thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it, I around five minutes thirty, I think there was really loud. At least on the video. Start going to that space, minute eight. something and then so here we are working together like so the everybody's doing something in their own thing but it's clear that we are working doing something together you know you see here and you are doing something there like now that was there and also I'm doing something there. So everybody's in their own world but we are sharing the Like in my notes, in some sound that goes into a ritual, and then a question mark. What does that mean? I don't know what that means, but it's just it's something that has a form, right? Uh, so I said like also break with pop songs for a life, but when you know um, because I think it's nice, but when? How long? So the intention has to be clear uh, from a structure perspective. Perspective. So from that perspective, also is in the note that I said like break from or practice is with pop songs. Uh, so I break with pop songs for a life, but also question mark when. Um, so 
So in the minute 9, the number of star distance is changed. And in minute 940, then you start focusing uh, uh, on the affordances of the, of the motion. So that you start from this is very formal and you didn't sound. And that's the place that I'm more interested. Right. Because the, the thing is the sound is so is really strong, it's like it's, it's really it has this texture. So what is interesting is like you have this thing. So the sound is there. You're moving out, but the sound is there. See? See as you have this? So you're making sound, but at some point you realize, okay, maybe it's more motion. I just don't want this, and then you like so then then it changes from a, uh, still the sound will be there because they're changing the sound, but then it's like about the affordances. So the sound is just a form. The aesthetic of the sound is a consequence of what you, how you're moving. It's not far away from this kid yesterday with the, with the, the polar bear. It's just the affordances of the testing how far you can go, and the aesthetics come as a consequence of the, uh, of the shape. Of the shape, in that case, like, yeah, it's just testing how far you can go without a fall. I think that the, the problem that I have with the sounds of play is that it can take you to the place where the sound is. So like, in, for instance, when I was doing my research with VR, also I found out that, that, so the extreme is music. If you put music, then you go into the mood. So I was doing, I put salsa, then I started like, it just has a specific, music has this thing. If you go to sound, then sound will allow you for more exploration. That was when I was researching VR and dance. So that was my, part of my conclusion, is that so sound was allowing me to be more curious. The goal, the goal for me was to find new ways of movement. But then with music, I would just start being happy, and then I start just like, oh, this is super fun. And, um, with sound, I have more possibilities of movement, but at the end, I just put it away. Because it still, it was putting me in certain spaces. The, it was taking too much space for me to be in the body awareness. So, uh, in, in, in this example, for instance, with Naoto, I think it's quite clear that, for instance, you can see your face at some point, you're reacting. Look. And I say, Tuna. Look. And then you're reacting to that. You see? Your body's reacting. So, uh, so you get affected because you have more space to sense make with your body what's going on. Uh, and still you're making the sound, right? Um, so anyway, there was like about like the movement affordances in relation to sound that I think that's to consider then how we tackle that. Uh, okay, so then... Uh, and this is really funny because it, so now so this is very interesting, you know, and this is just start from now that there's a change from 9.40 and in nine now that there's a change at minute nine, nine forty, you start focusing on the uh, on on the on the chain and by So this is like from 4, 9, 40 till, so it's less than one minute. Uh, I, I, I cut it uh, because I thought there was something important I needed to say. Um, it feels like important to it. I 
Anyway, so then that's, that's that. Um, I think, I don't think it's like I'm trying to say what is good or wrong, but I think if I would have been more uh, sensible, I could have noticed that there was something interesting that you were doing. Uh, so because it's, what I'm saying is just was one minute and then I caught you. I think I still, if I felt there was something in, because what I said it was important for me, that's why I said like stop, pay attention. Um, um, but maybe, I guess, I could have been more aware of the, what was going on. Yeah, but maybe that was my resistance to, you know, like not to let me talk. Like when I was talking, it was really like awkward, the way I was talking to you. But I'm not, I'm not there yet. Okay. Like, it's a different note. So, what I'm saying is that, it, what I'm saying is that it's just a note. That at that moment, I think uh, we, so me in this space, in the moment, could have been more aware that there was something happening. Uh, yeah. And I still give a space for the important thing to do. That's for me so much connected with this idea of grief. The more, yeah, when you, when, I pro when, you pro when we propose an idea, especially in that space, it's like constantly you're in, in that space for exposure, you know, like my, my idea will be good or not. So you, you, you're exposing yourself to be with your own narratives of people like me or don't like me. So it's a, it's a constant negotiation with grief. That I think in, my, in this case, somehow, I can say somehow like grief is connected to is there is a way how when something is like re there's a rejection. If I invite you for a coffee or if I invite you to stop, if I invite you for a coffee, right, and then you say no, I can take it in two ways. One that is often we do. Is it comes from an ego place and you say, I don't care. That's the way we normally, when we separate ourselves from the other, so in, in order to try to not feel hurt, we just say, like, oh, it's okay, so how internally we push it and we don't let it pass into the grief process. But that goes somewhere in the body and store, gets stored. Um, and in the space that we are improvising, is that's what we're doing constantly, but we are, so we are inviting each other to have a coffee and to see uh, especially when we said it's going to work. Um, so we need to find ways like each, each, each one to be conscious of, of that space. Because otherwise, like, I think it's an example uh, that in this case, for me, I think I was responding more from my from ego somehow. Um, but, uh, in a, since this is work, it's not personal. It's just the way of it. This is the speed of reaction. So it's about. I have an idea, and for instance, at the moment that I have the idea, it could happen. So at that moment, I didn't notice now Otto was in certain space. But when I stopped and I saw now Otto didn't move, so this is the eighth moment. Like, so I have an idea. So I think I have a really important things to say. So I, and so I, I said, like, please stop. I, have to, I want to say something. But then when I when I when I stop the music, I see that now this is still somewhere, right? And I didn't allow too much there to happen. So this is when I, this is when the ego space comes, um, because I know I feel I remember and I notice it. So I didn't address it in a way that could be performative and make it possible for an audience. It's just, uh, but it's just I notice that I just don't take into account. I just impose my idea. Um, yeah, but maybe like in time, I hope these things make more sense. Um, yeah. Okay, let's move to the uh, last one. Um, question from the menu. Yeah, so that was that. Probably answer. Ah, uh, yeah, so yeah, so it's, Pete said, like, so we start calling questions from the menu. So I start asking from the online space, right? And then uh, you respond. I try to make that as an interview, right? Um, then I go to Naoto, and then Naoto didn't lose the form, and then you answer in this way, and I think that's, I thought it was very interesting, I guess what I found the most interesting and is connected to the, uh, to what I was trying to say before. <laughs> Let me 
sense of is the awkwardness or is that space of grief, that space of under, not understanding, that's pure. So that's the space that I want to um, make it possible from other ones because there is not, not performative at all. It's just. Uh, maybe just to see if they show it for reason in that part. Yeah. Because the aesthetics come as a consequence of being honest. So time, time wise, it's like, and it's, it's the same. It's like from 12:27 till uh, 31:48, so a bit more than one minute. So it's not about the content, huh? It's not about what is that you're doing. What is it about the content? It's, it's about the relationality. I don't know what are you saying, but it doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. See, like in this moment, like for instance, you and me, we are both in this, like what's going on? Like we are like, physically we are like, what the fuck is happening? Like, I, like what, what, what is this happening? And because it's real in our bodies, that's also is, also is visible for the audience. Um, so this is very interesting because then you don't have to perform. So because I guess I was not sensible enough, I caught you quite short. Then I, because I have no idea what you're saying, I just don't address you, and I just take it from. It's not necessarily this good or bad. Like, also, it's hard to speak of. I'm speaking about work, but I'm speaking about my ego also. So it's a bit hard to do this exercise in being flat. But it, in what I'm saying is, it is about the ego. Like somehow I don't understand you, and it's, it's about my ego. But please don't put it in a personal level. It's because of work that I'm sharing this. So, I don't understand what are you saying, and I just think maybe my idea is cooler, or whatever. I just take it to a place that I know what's going on, because I don't understand what you're doing. And when the performance happens the same, you start speaking Japanese to me, and I also just react. So, it, that's the space of grief, because that's the space where people will try to pay attention. The rest is noise, right? Because this is really, the people will have these things all the time. like. They might feel un unconsciously, in a micro level, at a place where they don't know if it's for real or not. So it's really uncanny for them, like this is a space of grief. So they really have to consciously or unconsciously try to make a narrative on their head. Maybe they're playing, maybe not. I think this is close to what you were saying with the comedy in the performance. The, in the performance, what you were uh, sharing about the comedy. Um, yeah, it goes to the same space of helping the audience to, yeah, yeah, people will try to put it somewhere. Uh, so, yes, yeah, so I think this, this is moment for me was the, the most interesting is like when there are these misunderstandings. Um, but what was your reaction, not in the space, but watching this, me talking? What, what was my you know, reaction? How do you feel? It's still the same as when... No, like, I, I, I didn't feel anything. Because it doesn't matter. Like, it's not about the content, I think. So, like, in that moment... So, the way I feel when I was watching is that it was very funny. 
On the video. On the video. Like that it was that it has a lot the way I feel there is a lot of potential there. I feel there is because it's, it's a space that yeah, I just the thing that I just repeat. So the way I feel when I watch the video No, I think I didn't feel that attached to I guess I could feel that I was because I was watching from this choreographic perspective, right? So all dramaturgical perspective. So I'm just I saw it and I see oh wow, somehow I put it this funny. You can see this body there. After you there, you can see also you're like tense, what is going on. Um, but then like, it's more like I'm seeing from a choreographic perspective, like oh yeah. this is a space that is is so rich because we don't have time to do the process that normally uh, we will do in a dance piece. We just need to bypass what it is by use what it is in the space. Yeah. Like what it's real. Oh, was that in the space and watching? Um, in the space, yeah, I'm finding it really interesting now what you're saying because I, at the time I felt a bit like, uh, you know, intense because I, I felt like I did something wrong or, you know, like I sat so much. And it was also like you spoke first. Yeah. Oh yes, I did not. I didn't even think of that. Yeah. Yes. Um, no. But I, at the same time, yeah, I didn't know what it was, so it was like I had a feeling that I stepped on something, but I didn't know what the thing was. Yeah. Um, yeah, but then I think watching it, I just remembered that feeling, so I just cringed a bit because of my behavior. Yeah. 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 I think especially, because that's the time that we have before a performance, I think if something is happening and somebody has a sensibility that uh, or recognize her at the moment, we might find a way how to address that. Um, because on the stage we cannot do it. Meaning, for instance, if there is something that must be resolved or must be cared, then we maybe uh, Somebody can propose. I, I mean, I will try to think uh, in, to see if there are some moments to to kind of like stay there a bit, um, because I think that's what we have to have. But that's what we need to rehearse. The content will happen and it's fine. It will, it will, yeah, it's fine. Um, but what we need to rehearse is this. Like I think this thing through, and that was part of the name. That was part of what. Of or maybe working with Danny, we need to find time to to not re react. Uh, yeah, put it in the that map. It says to do anything by the channel. Oh, so, yeah. So to not immediately resolve through form. Yeah. So to not react, then we need to to have a pause before reacting. To not resolve through the form. The form meaning like I go to the next idea. So we have 20 minutes. Are you considering that or? I think I'm done. I'm finished. Yeah. It's, okay. Um, how do we do this? Because um, I was thinking, I just go through my notes and if you two think something is relevant, maybe after I go through the quick things we can talk about. Because Like this 
props in any part also. Um, I like that the, the time was shown, not the timer, because, yeah, timer is everything is too cringe. I think in the performance in February, we did countdown, but I feel like sticking to this time is, you know, just showing the, the time now. I, So in that example, sorry to interrupt you, but I think it's important to clarify that. So in that example, when I speak about the ego, it is connected, I don't know if this is from this book, no? so is that when you extend an invitation, then when you reply as in, I don't care, you do it from an ego first place. You don't, you don't allow this to do something with you that normally takes time. Um, which is the grief space. So when I'm speaking about the ego, is in, in connection to the grief. To basically, in that space of not understanding what you're saying, I respond as, I don't care. I mean, so I don't care is like, I just change the, the action um, uh, without letting do something to me because I didn't understand what was happening. Okay, maybe I see it from a different angle because that's interesting because that was when we were talking, right? That's, that process was like when I was saying something, you had to deal with this. In some way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because for me, that was like, it's it's already like, you know, done. When you but interrupted, it, that was the kind of contract. And then from there, I just do this game. But, it, but the thing is like, I'm trying to speak about you or me now, but like right now. I think that what I'm trying to take the space 
It's not about you or me, it's not about the content, it's about something that everybody can use. So, like in the example that I'm saying is specifically the, the way how I resolve the awkwardness of the situation with you is by saying internally, I don't care, I move somewhere else. Yeah. Uh, I think in that space, in that moment, because I, from the notes it seems interesting, it could have be, it could make it possible for others to access that space of awkwardness. Others if, if, I, if, I, if I dissolve myself into the awkwardness of the moment. But it's not about me or you or the content. It's more the situation itself. Yeah. Okay. In connection to the grief and this idea of the ego. But it's not Jorge's ego, it's what now does good or not good, or Jorge good or not good. It's not that. It's something that that to try to, to, to build together a toolbox. I don't think so much about like if it's good or not. Yeah, I mean I think mm, yeah, well maybe we can talk later. Because I think there's a lot of like different no, you know, like we're both we're both right. It's not that you know one is wrong or anything. And it's but to me what's it so okay, maybe like I would put it that way, like to me what's interesting is like how this can happen and how we deal with this, like each other, because we we see this very different how and the thing is I don't understand how you're seeing that. Like sorry, but the thing is like I don't see what what you're saying. I, I, I guess I don't understand. I, maybe you should go with your nose because I just stopped you. To to yeah, I stopped you. Yeah. Yeah. But maybe so we can go back later. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. I think this is yeah. I mean, this would be interesting if we if yeah, we, but then we need to understand each other. Yeah. Yeah. Right? yeah and so if we understand, understand each other, then yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, and then I was just moving with a with a leg um, to you know follow the beat. Really? But you're speaking of the whole of the of the two of the whole practice, right? Of the one hour. Yeah, because there are some relevant ones. That's why I would go through and then that's it. Yeah. Um but this this leg part is still within the fifteen minutes. Because which leg part? I don't remember. Because at after you were talking, you kept this rhythm somehow. Right. And then I was not moving, but my leg to follow, <coughs> try not to make a sound. That was my whole point. That I didn't want to make sounds, but I want to follow the rhythm. Didn't notice. Okay, so that was the intention. Okay. So that's I'm sharing, and I, I think uh, I visually it would feel really interesting. And yeah, I said to wait for the party, and then um, also like Romy wearing the, the jacket during this 15 minutes was interesting. Which jacket? The the sound thing. Yeah, that's really good. I was thinking yeah. that. Yeah, that's, that's really yeah. good. That's true. Um, the rest I will so quickly. Uh, for uh, narrating Hydra, I think it was good. I didn't understand at first, but it's good. Uh, what was the narration? We were saying that I'm black. I was like, wow. Ah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I was like, oh, okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and yeah. then I, yeah, then Robbie uh, being like here and they were like blocking my boots. So that was, I think it was good. Uh, we can try. Ah, because you were working out there. Yeah, and it's right. just like the boot just there, so like I was like, yeah. I don't know what to do. And I think that's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> and then also like uh, Robbie like doing a troubleshoot for Jorge's uh, like sound output or something, that was good. Mm, yeah, so it's, it's cool when you do the fire, uh, firefighting. Yeah, <laughs> and I was wondering like uh, maybe for the loop or something, maybe Jorge said something similar. For the what? For the loop machine or something, like can we use like pop? Sample in advance uh, or not? I mean, because it's just like a proposal or a question. question. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, like instead of like playing a whole song, for example, uh, it can be you know, like one song we might play, but then uh, we okay. play Rihanna, if we play like this, then it feels like you know that's a bit too much. I don't. Okay. Um, should, yeah, I think I should do more hyper stuff, uh, and I could also like narrate what I'm doing, like a tutorial. Uh, and I think the, the way we use the group was great. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. Thank you for sharing. So we have
Just fill 10 minutes. Um, Maybe you can think like what would to focus today or like I'm something that I really uh, so I so I wanted besides the structure this, this, uh, let's not go there before we need to define how long wait so uh, my proposal is that we do something similar as we did last time I don't want to think what but meaning that we at some point we come together and we work together. But, uh, what I want now to, to talk is in, uh, I think I would like if we don't, so in the 15 minutes that we don't use sound. Yeah. So, what does that mean? I don't know. But say for instance, like, like in the 15 minutes, like, I think the example is what you were doing with the chain, you know, but this could be also like this. This makes sense. sense. Yeah, yeah, so like, so that we consciously, during these 15 minutes that we are working together, we are not making sound. But, so like, this makes sound, right? But, yeah, I guess the example, I will not repeat myself, it's just, it's about the affordances of, of the object. So it would make sound. But so it's to take away the focus from the, to the sound, to avoid to go to that ripple space. Then if it happens, we'll see. But it's just, yeah, so I guess the invitation is to do that. So I mean, to avoid, make the sound, make music basically. Yeah. I would like that, to see and then check the, what happens and then. So you mean like, we can make sound but not music? No. No, because then it will have no. That's what I'm trying to be more like strict in the sense of we move. So the focus is on moving. So you can move objects, and because you move objects, the <coughs> depends on what you're doing. So that that's more the thing. Like we need to find the three of us something to do, and uh, then we are free to do anything, right? So then sound will appear. But that cannot be, so we are not focusing on making sound. We are focusing on moving and doing something together that is not defined yet. It has to emerge. It has to what? Emerge. It has to emerge. We have to see, we'll see what happens. Yes, and then for the time, time frame, so the practice, practice one hour. But then how long do we do the together time? Fifteen minutes? Oh, half past. Okay, let's do it the same. Yeah. same way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. And also the recording also in the 360 is like that. It's from so the 360 makes uh, 30 minutes automatically. Mm. So that's good. So basically we will start doing when we start working. The second part. Uh, I like conductor idea. I don't know if that would fit to that your idea or like because I also thought like the last fifteen minutes we could also think you know to find a form or something. I don't know. Like, I, I don't know. Like to you know, for example, me to actually work with high level stuff. Like my students yesterday. So like let's outlet like maybe 
ourselves and the last 15 minutes, well, so we do 30 minutes, then it's 15 minutes, and then the last 15 minutes, then everybody's doing something super cool. <laughs> exactly. You know, everybody's showing off. <laughs> then, then, then you're showing off what you got. Cool. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, let's do it like this. Like, and then we see what happens. Yeah. I mean, it's still like we need to be aware of the space and the other one. But we'll see. Yeah. we'll see what happens. Yeah. It's like a jam session. No, it's exciting. Exciting. Yeah. I think it's good. Like I think I should really like try to do no, 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 no pressure. No pressure. <laughs> I'm very shy. Oh my <laughs> god. I got it. Yeah, like I'm feeling like yeah, you're really nervous? Uh, no, not yet. I feel yeah. nervous. Yeah. I feel like oh I need to do something super. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's pretty cool. It's really cool. <laughs> I don't see anything like the last time was really cool, like from the few minutes. When? Really, really cool. At the end, in the last time. Yeah. 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 I was like, shit, the song, like, you know, ended like short, you know, like, it's like, we had like two minutes, I'm like, what, like, I want to go on with you. Like, can you not <laughs> play a song and, like, oh, well, they have a tape recorder, like, it's like two minutes. Oh, that's so, yeah, but also during, during the song, yeah, that's what they're using, like, French. <laughs> I didn't watch the last, uh, I didn't watch the whole thing. I can watch it, okay, yeah, what about my food? Oh, okay. So, yeah, yeah, we still like, uh, yeah. We have lunch. Yeah. I mean, we, yeah, I mean, we can just have lunch from now on, and we come back at, yes, half past one, and then we slowly warm up. I mean, I would say, like, you know, maybe, like, warm up. 15, 20 minutes, and then we have time to build that pitch before the okay. starting. So, yeah, so you're leaving, you're leaving the warming up. Yeah, that's